friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on WW Personal Points. Happy Sunday, it's Sunday and it is a random video day. I always put out a very random video on Sundays and today's video I am really, really excited about. I did a Shein Spring Summer Try On Haul a few weeks ago and you guys absolutely loved it. You loved seeing all the affordable spring and summer clothing. And as I've been doing my grocery shopping at Walmart, I'm noticing more and more that Walmart has stepped up their game. They're kind of like the more affordable on trend version of Target and they had some amazing clothes for spring and summer. I shopped in both the junior section and the just regular size ladies section as well. I have some items that I found on clearance that were could not pass up deals and then a lot of items that are just part of their stock for spring and summer that were incredible deals even at regular price or rollback price. I am going to link everything that I can find down in the description box for you. We're going to try it all on. I'm going to tell you sizes. If I like it, does it fit? Does it not fit? Is it cute? Is it ugly? We're also going to talk about prices and whether or not it's a clearance item or a regular stock item. I'm going to give you all the info on Walmart for spring and summer fashion. Let me just tell you that I spent under $90 for everything that I'm sharing in today's haul and there are a lot of pieces. If you're excited for an affordable spring and summer Walmart try on haul, give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell is turned on because I upload five videos a week. And like I said, Sunday's a random video day, so we do fun stuff on Sundays. Also check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching, where I offer personalized to you macros and calories and one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you would like accountability or to talk with me, you can utilize one-on-one -on -one coaching. You'll also find links and discounts to my favorite things, all the Walmart clothes I can find. And of course, come on over, join our Facebook group. We would love to have you. So without further ado, let's jump in to the try on haul and the review. For this video, this was the first time I put any of these clothing, any of this clothing on. I actually still left all the tags on because if it didn't fit or I didn't like it, I was I wanted the option to be able to return it to Walmart. So everything that I'm sharing with you today is my first impression of the clothing. And like I said, I have clearance and I have regular price clothing and there are some really, really really cute things for spring and summer. Since I live in Arizona now and it's a warm climate and it's sunny most days of the year, granted we do get down to the 60s or so during the winter, but we are in the heart of summer already. It is in the 90s here and moving from Washington, I didn't have a lot of shorts. I very rarely wore shorts in Washington and more than that, I very, very, very rarely wore shorts before I lost any weight. I just wasn't comfortable in them. They rode up, my thighs would rub together and the shorts would run up and I just didn't feel comfortable and confident in shorts, so I kind of avoided them. Fast forward to now, after losing over 110 pounds, I love shorts. I'm wearing shorts right now, and I decided to pick up a super cute pair of denim from Walmart. Now, on the take of this, it says they're $13.98, but they were actually a rollback of $10.98, $11.00 for denim shorts. And I don't own any black denim. I thought these were really cute. They are a little bit on the shorter side. They do have a rolled distressed hem, which I think is really cute. Of course, pockets in the back, the traditional button and zip up. And I just thought that these were really, really cute for $11. It does say here on the side that they are a four in inch inseam, which is a pretty short short, as you could see in the try on portion. I ended up picking up a size 12. I'll tell you a little funny story. I don't know what size I am. I still think I'm a bigger size than I am. And so in store, I had on workout pants. I slipped a size 14 over my workout pants and they were way too big. So I knew that I needed to size down to a 12. So I grabbed a 12, didn't try them on, just threw them in my cart. And to my pleasant surprise, I actually could go down another size to a size 10, which is crazy to me when I was a 22, 24 at my heaviest weight that I could easily fit into a size 10. Now these do have a little bit of stretch to them. Size 10, I mean, 
that's incredible. So I did end up getting a size 12. I am going to go ahead and keep them as I continue to lose weight. If they become a little bit loose, I can throw a belt on and I do plan on throwing these through both the washer and the dryer. They had tons of different denim colors, black, white. They had some striped shorts, really cute. In fact, I'm thinking if they're still 1098, I need to pick up a couple more pairs. And with the denim shorts in the try on, I had this super cute top. It is kind of like a tie dyed black and gray. And I thought this would be great for working out. I love the length of this. It is quite long, as you can see. This is a size 0X, which is a 14W. Now, they did not have this particular tank top in any straight sizes. I believe this is plus size, but it is a 0X, 14W. It is quite biggie on me. This is another item I'll be throwing in the washer and the dryer. This little tank top right here was $5. And I thought for $5, it can be a little bit baggy, or it could be pajamas, a workout top. It is incredibly, incredibly soft. And again, I do really like the length of it because it's long enough that it kind of covers your bum. And I thought it was super cute with the denim shorts. Next up was this yellow shirt. If you follow me in my Facebook group or on Instagram, I'm loving orange and yellow for spring and summer. And I saw this and I thought that it was so incredibly cute. This shirt was actually from the junior section. They were pretty sold out. So I ended up having to get a size XXXL, which is a 21 in juniors. I don't even know what that means in women's sizes, but you can see that it is very, very big on me. I definitely needed to size down at least three or four sizes in order for this to fit me the way that it should. I love the color. I love the straps and the bunching here at the neckline. I love that there's this fun little keyhole in the back, but as much as I love this, I think I'm going to have to return this because it's just way, way, way too big for me. There was nothing smaller. So I thought I would give it a try because it's a junior's. And again, I, again, I don't even know really what size I wear, but unfortunately it's just way too big. Let me know down in the comments, what did you think of it in the try on portion? Do you think I should keep it? I should return it. I'm just afraid that from the side, it makes me look pregnant because there's just so much extra material but I do think it's absolutely adorable. And it was $10.98. For spring and summer, I am all about dresses. You guys know I've been wearing a lot of dresses and skirts. I find that they keep me cooler because it allows some airflow. They're really, really comfortable. So I saw that Walmart had so many cute dresses. Some of these dresses were on clearance, which I couldn't believe because they're this season's dresses. The first dress that I tried on is this super cute, horizontal striped black and white dress. First of all, I'm wearing horizontal stripes. Again, that would have never happened. I would have never worn stripes in any fashion. And now I'm actually choosing horizontal stripes. I love that this cute dress has pockets. It falls at the perfect length, just right above my knees. It is a very, very soft material. It feels nice and thick and well made. I did end up picking mine up in a size medium, which is a size eight to 10, and it's $9 and 98 cents. And that is not on clearance. That is the price that these cute little tank top midi dresses are selling for. They had solids, they had stripes, they had so many different dresses, but I just fell in love with the black and white stripe, even though, even though it's a horizontal stripe. Now this next dress was actually on clearance. The regular price was $15 and it was on clearance for $10. This is the Time and True brand again, and it is a size large 12 to 14. Number one, I love, love, love the color of this dress. I think it's beautiful. I love this tie around the waist. I think this is extremely flattering no matter your figure. You can make it a little bit tighter, a little bit looser, tight in the front, tight on the side, and it just draws in your waist, which is generally one of the smallest parts of our body. I also like that it is short sleeved instead of tank top, and I love, love, love the length of it. It is a midi length. It falls nicely mid calf, which I know is really important if you're taller or you just don't wear shorter dresses. I feel like this dress is the perfect length. It fit me really, really well. It was a little bit snug snug was a little on the snug side, which I think is how the dress is supposed to be. I definitely wouldn't size down to a medium. I think the large was perfect and $10. Now this dress I thought was literally the cutest thing I've pretty much ever seen. This was also on clearance, normally $13 and on clearance for $8. It is a size large juniors. 
junior size large, which is an 11 to 13. Now I put this in my cart, took this out of my cart, put this in my cart, took this out of my cart because I thought there's no way this is going to fit me. First of all, if I wear juniors, I would think that I would need to up a size, which if I'm a large normally, I would need to go to at least an extra large in juniors. But to my pleasant surprise, this fit me really nicely and I love everything about this little dress, especially the price of $8. I do love that it has the cute little collar and this lace panel in the back I think is extremely flattering. It does have some ruching here and a little bit of an open back. You can see that it does have buttons down the front and these are actually functioning buttons with a tie waist that just ties in the back. Now the length of it is a little bit more on the shorter side, but it still is long enough and I'm pretty tall, I'm 5'8", but I think feel comfortable wearing this without having to wear something underneath it, but it is a little bit on the shorter side. I just love the floral pattern. I love all of the fun detail. And like I said, $8 for a cute little summer dress, you can't pass it up. And the last dress that I picked up, this is another one that went into my cart and out of my cart. I wasn't sure if I would like it. And honestly, it's probably my favorite of the entire four dresses that I bought. And that is this cute little tennis style dress with a white striped sleeve. They did have this in a few different colors. I decided to go with black because I thought that I could put some fun colored sandals with this and some fun colored jewelry and really jazz it up a little bit and add some pops of color. This again is a Juniors. It is the No Boundaries brand and this one is actually an extra extra large or a 19 in Juniors. The regular price of this dress was $12.98 and it was on clearance for $8. That was another reason that it made its way into my cart. I also am in love with the material. You can see that it is kind of a ribbed material and it is so lightweight and soft, but you can't see through it, which I really appreciate. I love the neckline. It has a cute little collar like the traditional tennis dresses and a beautiful V-neck. It really accentuates your decollete area, which is very sexy on a woman. So I do like that. I think it's a very flattering neckline. It does go all the way up in the back and I love of the shorter sleeves with the white stripes. Now I could have sized down in this dress. I probably could have went with an extra large or even a large in juniors. Like this was just a large in juniors. But I think throwing this through the washer and putting it on a high heat dryer will kind of shrink it down to the right size. The last thing I love about it is how it flares out at the bottom because it just makes your shape look really nice. I think it's very slimming. Whether it's black or not, it's a very slimming cut of dress. And again, it was an $8 dress. This next outfit is 1 million percent out of my comfort zone. And again, I almost didn't pick this up, but it was on clearance for such a great deal. I'm like, what does it hurt? You can always take it back if you don't like it. This is this two-piece floral set. You can see that it has the stretchy kind of ribbed top of the skirt with this cute little lace detail at the bottom. I was afraid that this was going to be super, super short and it's not. It actually falls at a really, really good length. I also was afraid that it would be really scratchy. It's not scratchy at all. This is a juniors and this is no boundaries and this is an extra large as well in size 15 to 17. Now the skirt, I definitely could have sized down and it would have fit just fine. This fits, it's just a little bit loose, which I'm not mad about. I love the cute little ruffle detail at the bottom and I'm really thankful that it fell right above my knee. So a really good length. The top is also in XL Juniors 15 to 17. This top is a crop top and it is a crop top that sits right below your boobs. So I was not sure how I felt about that. I don't wear crop tops. I don't want to show my stomach. I'm in my late 40s. I was thinking you're way too old for this shirt, but pairing it with the skirt because it is pretty high waisted, you only see this much of my stomach. And honestly, I could even pull the skirt up to touch with the shirt directly, and then you wouldn't see any of my stomach. I do like that it has this little string here to tighten it around the bust so that it holds everything in place. I really think the sheer little cap sleeves are adorable, and it does have that nice stretchy material, the same stretchy material that the skirt has. This little number was on clearance, so the entire set the top and the skirt was $5. So I had to get it. I had to see if it was something that I would wear. And to be honest with you, I'm comfortable in it. I definitely will pull the skirt up as 
high as I can to show as little stomach as possible, but I think it's really cute. I think it would be fun for like a little date night or a little picnic outside. I think it's really cute and you can't beat it for $5. And lastly, I picked up a loungewear set. So I wear pajamas and loungewear all the time and I first saw the pants and then I saw the top and I thought it's on clearance it's an incredible deal I'm going to grab it so the pants are way too big for me these are actually the no boundaries brand they're normally $11 and they were on clearance for $7 they are a juniors XXL 19 I definitely could have sized down at least two sizes maybe three luckily it does have a functioning drawstring waist so I can tighten them and their loungewear so it's okay if they're big and baggy the bottom of them also have a cuffed bottom so they sit really nicely even though they are on the bigger side as I was walking out of the junior section I spotted the matching top and this is just a racer back top it is a crop top so it is a little bit on the shorter side. This is a size large in junior size. I wish I could have found the pants in, but they were sold out. So this actually fits perfect. This is a size large, 11 to 13, again in juniors. Normally $5 on clearance for $3. So the entire outfit was about $10. Again, the top, the top fits really well. It is a little bit cropped for me. I'm still not 100% confident in really cropped shirts. I don't mind the ones that sit at my waist, but this one is a lot shorter. Because it's loungewear and I can pull these pants up a little bit higher, I feel really comfortable in it. And the material is incredibly, incredibly soft. I love the cute pink, orange, black tie-dye. I will definitely get lots of use out of this. Besides the clothing section of Walmart and really the home decor section of Walmart, their jewelry section can't be beat. I wanted to stop by and see if there were any pieces that were on a really good deal or any pieces that spoke to me. And I found these super cute black and white hooped earrings for $1. I love the little tie on them. They are kind of a black and white tie-dye and I thought they would be really cute with the black denim shorts and that black tie-dye tank top. And again, a dollar on clearance was a great deal. They had a couple of other colors as well, but I know that I'll get a lot of use out of the black and white. Now this wasn't on clearance, but you guys, this necklace was $3.98. Sense. It is rose gold. I love the kind of dainty circle, some faux diamonds, rhinestones in there. It just has a really pretty sparkle. I love rose gold jewelry and I don't have very many rose gold necklaces. So I thought for $3.88, oh, $3 I had to pick this up. It says it's an 18 inch short necklace, but it also includes an extender. So if you do want to make it longer or if you need an extender for your necklace, it actually includes one. And I couldn't believe it for $3.88. So I did grab a necklace and a pair of earrings as well. And then on my way out, I made a quick run through the shoe section because I've seen some really cute Walmart shoes on TikTok and YouTube. But unfortunately, I couldn't find anything that I really love. So I didn't end up picking any shoes up. But if you watch my videos, my what I eat in a days, I've been buying lots and lots of sandals at my local Ross and TJ Maxx. So I recommend checking out those stores as well for affordable clothing, jewelry, and shoes. So that is my Walmart spring and summer haul. Can you believe I got all of that for less than $90? dollars. I am going to keep everything with the exception of the yellow top. It's just a little bit too big for me. I know it was really affordable, but I'm continuing to lose weight. So it's just going to get bigger and bigger on me. However, I do want your guys' opinion down in the comments, whether you think I should keep it. I will wait to return it until this video goes live and I can read through your opinion of the yellow shirt. Everything else I'm comfortable with. I love it. It's affordable, super cute. And like I said, Walmart has just really stepped up their clothing game. They are a mini target, a more affordable target, and I am here for it. Also, let me know down in the comments what was your favorite outfit. And again, I will do the best that I can to link everything down below for you. It's a little hard to find clearance items on the Walmart website, but definitely check your local store. Even though they're spring and summer clothes, they're still on clearance. So check your local store, see if you can find some great deals. And if you enjoyed another affordable try on haul, give this video a big, huge thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed and your bell is turned on because I do upload five days a week and Sunday is just a fun random video day. So make sure you're subscribed. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching as well as links and discounts to my favorite things. And don't forget to come on over, join us on Facebook. We would love to have you. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.